us on headlines now. Let's bring you some news from the world of sports now and in World Cup uh, 2011 as well. It's official. Temperamental uh, fast bowler S. Trishant will replace injured Praveen Kumar in the 15-member squad for this month's ICC World Cup to be played in the subcontinent. In a selection between the Kerala Pesa, Ishan Charma and Vinay Kumar, the BCCI has decided to replace Srishanth in place of Praveen Kumar. India's fastest bowler underwent uh, a fitness test at the National Cricket Academy in Bangalore to gauge whether he had recovered from the injury sustained before the start of the one-day series in South Africa last month. Unfortunately, Praveen couldn't do all that was asked of him. Srishant uh, has established himself in the test side though, but uh, has been on the fringes of the one-day outfit. And the new entrant to the team spoke to NDTV. Here's how he reacted to the news of the inclusion. Uh, uh, how do I say? I, um, I think, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I've just got the news like three minutes back and I'm, I'm on the phone with you all. So, uh, yeah, I'm trying to uh, yeah, sing in and uh, join the team from practice. I've been, I've been training at the NT and uh, looking forward to the game and uh, whatever the team wants me to do, I do that. And uh, yeah, uh, tomorrow is what where we all get together and uh, I'm going to the matches and the training. So uh, being humble enough also, that's what the main mantra of the team is. So I'm just concentrating on my practice sessions and my training. Uh, I think I, I and um, I'm li really looking forward to it because uh, everybody is so much experienced and uh, I think uh, it's a great opportunity for me to uh, learn a lot about the game and especially World Cup being in India, I think. Um, yeah, uh, I'm looking forward to it for sure. Well, just 11 days left more for the World Cup. Ian Gardens in Kolkata has finally got the stamp from the ICC. The stamp of approval and heaving a huge sigh of re relief for our Kolkata fans. A three-member ICC team has approved of the Eden Garden Stadium to host the three non-World Cup uh, matches. That's the ones where India would feature. Uh, former BCCI Chief Jagmohan Dalmia held talks with uh, the ICC seeking permission to host the India-Ireland match in Kolkata. So with just a few days away, the biggest, most exciting cricket extravaganza takes off. Fans are already into some serious shopping, it seems. And many retailers are wooing cricket lovers with everything from handbands titled aptly as such to caps and team jerseys as well. Join our sports reporter Sudarshan Kumar as he checks out the big buys this cricket season. Only two weeks to go to the countdown to the World Cup 2011 and the buzz is beginning to build up over accessories that fans go for. Big Bazaar expects a 10% growth in its sportswear, as does Nike, the co-sponsor of the Indian cricket team. ICC itself is expected to rake in over 4.5 crore rupees from the sale of World Cup merchandise. And uh, slowly it has started picking up now. I think uh, before uh, World Cup starts, we will uh, expect a good card of uh, customers to come in and buy the RCC merchandise. Due to this World Cup thing, we have been selling most of the Indian jerseys in a huge numbers. It has been a very good hike for the World Cup season. A steady trickle of customers to these showrooms has already begun. And surprisingly, not everyone wants to buy the Indian team jerseys. No sir, some of them want to pick up accessories of other teams. No, 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 we are not picking. I always like New Zealand, that's because I love black. Uh, obviously, it is India's jersey. I support India and Jai Ho India. Uh, I like this, this edition jersey because it is better than the last time. Shopping for cricket memorabilia is serious business. No wonder now that Big Bazaar has divided the sportswear segment into four groups. The true cricket lover, graphic range, stumpy range and the true blur fan tee. Now the price of the Indian jersey is as low as 199 rupees, whereas maximum price is fixed at 449 rupees. So have you bought a jersey of your favourite team yet? But the question is, will the new jersey bring luck for Team India in the World Cup? Well, we'll have to wait till the 2nd of April to know the answer. In China, with Sadarshan, this is Ashmit Kumar for NDTV Hindu. Well, I'm going to be taking a stuffy stumpy for my side. Uh, but I don't know about you. Make sure you do rush to the stores before they really finish off with all of that. That's all we have on Headlines now. But I leave you with Kyo, Ningo and Oshi, the traditional Japanese dolls that's been showcased in the city. Thanks so much for being with us.